Hello and welcome to my e-lesson. I am your guru and in this video, I will tell you how you can make a pivot table from multiple sheets. Let's take this example. This is sheet 1. I have the product ID, product name and the product price over here. And in sheet 2, I have the product ID, product price, salesman name, region name, quantity sold and sale amount. Now see the difference is we don't have the product name over here, correct? And that is available in sheet 1. Now I can use these two sheets to make a single pivot table, alright? So there are certain aspects that we need to be careful about before doing that. One of them is making a table out of this range, alright? So we will have to select this data and then press control and the T key, control T and this will be converted into a table, alright? So this is now a table, we can give it a name from here, let's say product name. All right, so I've given a name to this table. Now I'll go to sheet two. I'll select this data. And now in the home tab, there is format as table option. So I'll use this option to make a table out of this. So my table is again created. It has headers, of course it has headers. Click OK, the table is created. I'll give it a name, say sales rep. All right, and done. Now, the second aspect that I need to consider before making a pivot table from multiple sheets is going to data and clicking on relationships. All right, so we need to get into a relationship over here, do we? <laughs> so I'll click on relationship and then click on new. Now, this is the relationship table. Herein, the first thing that you need to do is you go to related table and select your main table, all right, which is say product name, all right. Now, just like in VLOOKUP, there has to be a common identifier between two ranges. Similarly, in our case also, we have a common identifier, which is the product ID. So I'll choose product ID over here. Now, I'll choose the second table which I want to link, which is the sales rep table. And then, in this column foreign key, I'll click again product ID. The, I'll again choose product ID. These two have to be the same, alright? Because this would be the base of the lookup and we have different tables over here. Now, click OK. The relationship is ready and done. If you want to see it, you can see it also. Let me show you how. I'll just click on power pivot. Go to manage. I'll go to design. I'll go to manage relationships. I'll click on edit and see. Here is the relationship. Table 1 and table 2. They are connected. This was just to show it to you. You don't need to have power pivot in your version of Excel to create a a pivot table from more than one table all right so now now this is created our table is created all we have to do is just create our pivot table from multiple sources so i'll create a pivot table go to insert click on pivot table and now i get this option use this workbooks data model because that is what we did when we created that relationship we created our data model where will I want this table to be located? In a new worksheet, click OK. And you see over here, there are two ranges. See, product name table is here and the sale rep table is here. Now I can link both. Say for example, I want the product name from the table called product name and I want the sales rep who sold that product from the other table. So I'll have it here. Now you see, we have been able to get data from two tables into one pivot table. If you see our sheet number one, there is the product name, correct? In sheet number two, the product name is not mentioned at all. Still, we were able to match 
the product name with the sales rep name. Similarly, I can even fetch more details like region. Remember in sheet one, there is no region, correct? But I can have the region also over here. I get the region into filters. Now I can choose, say just only East region. So I'm getting data of East region. Isn't this cool? So this is how we go ahead and make a pivot table from multiple sheets. Well, this file is available for practice and for download on my website, myelesson.org. Do go over there and download this file so that you can see the ready-made built-in relationship and the ready-made table that I have created for you. All right. I want you to go ahead and practice it so that you can master this art. This is amazing. And do not forget to like this video and do subscribe to the channel so that whenever a new video comes, which comes almost three days, every three days, so you can get to know about it and do share this video with your friends. So until the next video, this is your guru now signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.